Such are characteristic of settings at fish landing sites in Uganda. Fishing boats on one side, youth gathered in groups on another, as girls and women go about their chores. As fishermen celebrate their catch, something could render such celebration short-lived. Here at Kagwara landing site, in the Teso district of Serere in eastern Uganda, HIV AIDS is still a challenge. The situation of HIV, as we talk now, it has, it has lowered compared to those early days because people have achieved trainings, they have achieved, they, have, they, know, what, they know what HIV brings. It is partly blamed on reckless lifestyles by the youth. When they take uh, this uh, marijuana, when they take beer, they cannot accept the advice being given to them by, uh, by the VHTs, by the uh, Ministry of Health, and also TASO. 43-year-old Jane Akol Anero is an HIV AIDS counselor who is also a victim. She has lived with the virus for the last 18 years. Living positively, she doesn't wish any other person to fit in her shoes. Auntie, I used to, to swallow my drugs well. I used to keep my time. I used to stay safe with only one person. The president of Uganda recently emphasized prevention as one of the most effective measures in fighting HIV AIDS. And the reason for avoidance being the best solution is that if you get infected, even when we put you on these treatments, there are certain activities which need a lot of physical exertion, which you may not manage. Like, for instance, army work, joining the army. It is a gospel that she has been spreading since the early days of HIV AIDS in the country. When my children were growing up, I told them that getting AIDS is an act of treason. Because you, you, you are responsible for of treason. If somebody is committing treason, you are arrested. So getting AIDS is an act of treason. You betray your family. To Jen Akol and Nero, the scourge can be dealt a blow if all measures are embraced. People using, living with HIV AIDS, they should be with it. Hope that even though you are living with, with, with HIV AIDS, you cannot produce a, a baby with, a, with what? Who is positive? It is not clear how many Ugandans have been this optimistic. What is open for all to see is that the country is on course to end HIV AIDS by 2030. Henry Okrut, UBC.